What's up guys, welcome back to Sandboy Boy Adam Slink. How are you guys doing? Good morning, afternoon, evening, depending on where you guys watch this video from. I do not know the next step, but, but basically just announced that he or she does not longer have a pecker. She said, or he said, from he transition to she. She said, let me make officially break the news i now have a vagina haven't taken off order even before my pop surgery she said she now has a punani after removing the cucumber even before a boob surgery so address me as a woman cause we all girls collect cucumber the same way. So do you think is bluffing or is just saying his mind? Or she just saying her mind? Anyone you want to use? Do you think Bob Briskin is bluffing? In the sake of her saying that he has removed it, I think we should believe. And again, the, 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 the main thing, the main reason why Nigerians are troubled, are kind of like worried about this, uh, the main reason is because of our traditional religious belief. All those things are not yet fully accepted by Nigeria. Despite our government are stylishly trying as much as possible to ignore those kind of statements, those kind of behavior in our society, mainly, mainly because of sanction. Yeah, that is the main reason they are ignoring it. There's nothing else. It's mainly because of sanctions from international body. That is why the federal government are not paying one close attention to this at all they don't want to nigeria is not ready to start facing sanctions according to our politicians so nigeria is not ready to stop getting loans from the world bank nigerians are not ready to stop getting relief materials to stop getting our investment from the european country nigerians are not ready the country is not ready that's why the politicians we never pay close attention to it. Even if you decide to share from now to tomorrow, they will never. Just check out Ghana. Immediately, Ghana, uh, the lawmaker out there, the lawmaker in Ghana passed the bill to jail any LGBTQ or any LGBTQ sympathizer to three to seven years in prison. Guess what? The World Bank threatened that they might stop funding Ghana. Like they get grant from World Bank close to 3 point something billion yearly. And the USA alone give them like 150 million US dollar yearly or some more. So the threats came. The threats came. And the governor, the president is the president immediately transfer the thing into Supreme Court. So the Supreme Court will have to decide, yeah, decide if that law will stand or not. The president didn't sign it. So you see the reason why I said Nigerian government will not pay any simple close attention. Simple close attention to LGBTQ in Nigeria because we are not ready not to get fund, not to get loans from the World Bank, not to get investment from those European countries. We are not ready. We are not ready. We are not ready. We are not ready. So guys, even if you decide to shout from Nati tomorrow, there is no law for that. There is no law against transgender. There's no law against cross-dressing. There is absolutely no law. So even if they arrest, they will still release them. Because you arrested them and against their fundamental human rights. Because there's no law. There's no law that actually give any 
agency any or power no power at all to arrest people like obviously never we are not ready to stop receiving fund <laughs> at all we're not ready so do not expect say make federal government they initiate that law here yeah? don't expect it to don't expect it so Bobrisky announced that he has removed it. Good for him. It's his own. It's his own specker. He can do whatever I want to use it, do, do, do it all, reconstruct it. But I would like to interview him to ask him, how does he feel? Does he have the same sensation? Like, how does he feel? Do you feel the same way? I can't, I can't even decide to, to think how it, how it feels though, honestly. Well, <laughs> I'm still trying to th even thinking about it and reasoning it. You get that you're doing for body. Well, Bob, continue to do it. And uh, let's talk about your doji. You know, uh, for those of you, I just hope Lou Kama was here. I would have showed him this video. <laughs> then I know he's going to get irritated as well. You know, the more I just think about it, the more the hatred, the more they do it. And because the internet now pays. If the internet does it pays, eh, I do not think anybody will see the need to post anything. And again, by posting something, by posting something, it's either you post something that is attractive to the viewers. And Yole Doche and, and uh, Jude are doing it really, really well. There are videos they post online and noise a lot of viewers. And those viewers cannot stop watching at the same time. If you claim so well that your Ledoche picture annoys you that much, then why do you keep watching? As an hater, you claim your Ledoche and his wife video annoys you. Have you asked yourself? Why do you keep watching your Lidoche and his wife? Why do you tolerate their sight? Why do you keep clicking on their, vid on their videos to watch? Because the more you click, the more they make money on TikTok, on Facebook, and on, 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 on Twitter, and many other social media outlets out there. Why do you keep uh, clicking? You are obsessed. You cannot stop. You can't stop watching. That's just it. And they will never stop. Because they are capitalizing on that your obsession. They will continue to capitalize on it, capitalize on it until you have drained your spirit. So my advice to you is that if you do not like your Lidoche and his wife, just simply look the other way. Do not click on their videos. But unfortunately, you can't because you are obsessed. <laughs> so they are burning, they are cashing out on your obsession that is just a simple uh, historical truth about the history of social media and how to make money from social media that is just it guys nothing else nothing absolutely else <laughs> it's crazy now <laughs> okay uh, that being said uh, Let's check out this video between Governor Soludo versus his commissioner. Governor Soludo versus his commissioner. It, uh, it's a trending video online currently. Check it out, guys. It's being built. You stop it, you come and bulldoze it down. If I come here again and I see any of these rubbish, I'll smack you publicly. I'm confident. They began it and you are watching it going on and you didn't bring it down. Where is the walkway? Come and show me the walkway. Come and show me. Bring it down. Stop it and it's going on. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Coming out on the road. Who changed it? Who changed it? This is not here. This is supposed to be there. So what? 
Don't say, okay, you tell me the person, tell me the officer, and I'll kick him out. Let me tell you, oh, 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 we must regenerate. This chaos must end. See, all these shops, all these shanty shops along this road that is attached to the wall, this fence, the fence must go back, and you have at least one meter where people can walk. No, 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 that's what you stop, but it's gone on and you've done nothing. But I stopped. I, and I'm just telling you, pull this thing down tomorrow. Friday, today, tomorrow is a Friday, Thursday. By tomorrow, this wall must be off. And they must go at least one meter up there. And they get me the paper who approved it, and I've sacked that person tomorrow. Get me, whoever, if anybody approved this, that person is leaving my government tomorrow. Okay? Let them get me who, who, who approved this thing to be done this way, and I will dismiss that person tomorrow. Get me the paper. Well, everybody now want to act like uh, Abia stayed there, governor. You know, with cameras around and everything, they're just politicians. Well, for those of you who are there, please let us know if that, if that, if that building was, if that building went down, just let us know. Let us know if that building really went down or not. Mm -hmm. Let us know, guys.